You probably heard the news already. It's everywhere. Microsoft has officially bought Minecraft for $2.5 billion. I'm not kidding. I'll put uh, I'll put an article in the description. There's hundreds. I'm sure of it. Uh, they bought it for $2.5 billion. Uh, Notch said he wants to retire. Uh, I think they also acquired Mojang as well. So what does this mean? First off, I just want to point out, I don't give a shit about Minecraft. I, I, it's, it's not a terrible game. It's not the worst game I've ever played, but it's far, far from the best. I, I don't... I've tried it on multiple platforms. I've tried the Xbox 360, the Xbox One, the PC, and the iOS, uh, and none of them... I just never really found it that fun. But that aside, I do feel like I know quite a bit about video games and business uh, and things of that nature. So let me just dive into this. Now, a lot of people's knee-jerk reaction is they're going to stop supporting the PlayStation and the iOS version and focus on uh, the Xbox, the X, or the Xbox One, the Xbox 360, and Windows platforms. Well, Microsoft has gone out and said in multiple ways they're going to keep supporting iOS and they're going to keep supporting PlayStation. Basically, yeah, that I mean, that's not like Minecraft is just too damn big for them to just pull the plug. Maybe once the game is not really being played anymore in 10, hell, maybe even 20 years. Because it's, honestly, it's that big of a game. I mean, Sky does Minecraft, he has like 10 million subscribers, and if that's a game that he primarily plays, damn. Anyway, uh, they're going to keep supporting it, and they said they'll keep having updates, but what I'm thinking is they'll probably put out one more update Maybe another after that, but not that much after that for the iOS and the PlayStation, because they don't want to. Now, that's just uh, a, hy- a hypothesis by me, but you can really think whatever you want. But on a business standpoint, this wasn't a good idea of Microsoft at all. Now, $2.5 billion, that's a shit ton to anybody. Uh, I doubt... I'm going to make that much in my lifetime. I'm sorry to say, but you probably won't make that much in your lifetime. You can prove me wrong. Um, But it's not really that much to Microsoft. That's probably... And that's part of their annual revenue overall. Just like a part of it. But then again, Minecraft isn't really earning that much anymore. They still earn a lot. It's still relevant game. But Minecraft's peak is gone. It's long gone. So it's not going to really make $2.5 billion back. At least. I doubt that Microsoft will think they're going to make a profit. They. It's not really pissing me off that they did this. It wouldn't. But it's really not. I just find it weird. I mean $2.5 billion. That could have gone to a lot of other things. That could have gone to purchasing. That honestly, you couldn't. You didn't have to pay two point five billion. You could have paid significantly less, and the rest of that, from the small whatever this two point five billion, you're probably just pulling out of your ass. Could have gone to buying a lot of other intellectual properties. Now, buying up the third party is fine. It's completely fine, in my opinion. If you buy third party. Uh, just to make your console sell better, because this is most likely due to the Xbox One's poor sales. It's not doing piss poor, but it definitely could be better uh, next to PlayStation 4, and all in all, it just could be better. It could be tweaked. There are some things that I feel like they should put in. Uh, I've been playing a shit ton of the Xbox One lately, and i got to tell you, it is very foreign compared to the 360. Can't 
do as much casual things as you can do on a 360. But putting that aside, buying up third party is completely fine. But getting back to the uh, the money, Minecraft probably has exceeded overall 2.5 billion. And I'm not just talking game sales because I'm not sure how much it is on, for the PC. I think it's five for the Xbox 360. I think I saw something like that. Um, and I think it's like six or seven on iOS. Although the iOS, I'd, I got to tell you, it, it isn't really that great. Out of all the ones I've tried, it's definitely the weakest, which is pretty obvious. Um, but uh, it's definitely made more. It's made more with all sales, and also it's made more with t-shirts and costumes and the, the foam swords or pickaxes or just publicity overall. But Microsoft is really looking at the entire overall revenue of Minecraft. Saying, oh wait, it made, um, I'm just going to estimate here, $5 billion in only a few years. Let's buy them up. It's very odd to me. And Review Tech USA was saying, they Microsoft is ballsy enough they could make a Minecraft 2. Because they are ballsy enough to do that. They have milked their series before Halo, although I love it. I'm, I will admit, they kind of milk it in certain ways. Um, they bend down on one knee for Activision. And if they made a Minecraft 2, I'm sure the sales would go beyond anything. I don't think it's happening. But it could. Microsoft is that ballsy. And also, I think uh, Minecraft would have been good on uh, Windows. Uh, no, not Windows. Wii U. I play Wii U with Venom a lot. And um, I think the gamepad could really help with it. I think it would be good, be good overall on Wii U. But it's probably not coming now. It has a small chance before. But I think it has an even smaller chance of coming now. Even if Microsoft was open, all, open arms, we all know Nintendo. We all know they can be brats. Anyway, tell me what you guys think about this. Uh, I'm going to go play some more um, Assassin's Creed 4, but tell me what you think. Thanks for listening. Bye.